with this demonstration, uh, to keep control of the horse's head, I'll put on the war bridle first off. I keep talking about the war bridle and uh, for those that haven't seen it or don't know anything about it, it really is just uh, a piece of rope. When you do pull on it, the quick release is essential. It must be given back within seconds. The size of the rope, uh, the thickness of it should be probably inch, inch and a quarter. That should be all that you'd require to use. Uh, you can make these ropes up yourself. Uh, they need an eye in one end or a ring. I prefer the ring myself because it aids with the quick release. The quicker that that rope releases, the better the action. And I must stress again that you must release instantly when you're using this rope. If the horse rushes backwards and you've got a war bridle on it, run with the horse. Don't try and hold it and don't try and pull it. Give him plenty of time to think and try and settle him down. Good boy. Don't try and hurry things, it's got to take a little bit of time. It's not going to take long to put this horse on the float, but it's going to take a little bit of time to teach him to stay on there.